Hello everyone. I thought I'd make a video here about this coax switch. And when talking on ham radio, if you hook two radios to the same antenna with a T splitter, when you key one radio down, RF will go to the other radio on the antenna and burn up the radio. <clears throat> I learned this the hard way. I burned up two radios. When I first got my license, I didn't hardly know what I was doing. I was new to ham radio. Uh, a good friend of mine recommended this switch. I got it on eBay. It's a Daiwa brand, and here is the package. A CS201 coaxial switch. That's the packet came in. It cost less than $40. Here is my antenna going in. This goes to my JPO outside. It's up 40 feet. Low loss cable LMR 400. This jumper goes to my Yezu 2900, puts out 75 watts. Without this switch, this RF would go into my handheld that I use for 440, 70 centimeters. So I can flip this switch like it is now and talk on my Yezu 2900 2 meter repeaters, switch it back. And talk on 440 without having to keep continuing to disconnect my antenna to hook to this radio hook the antenna to that radio and back and forth I just flip the switch so now it's flipped over to the handheld 440 I hit, I hit the repeater because the green light came on I've done been using it so it hasn't burned up either radio now I'll flip it back to the other radio key that mic as you see I hit that repeater that repeater must be turned off I hit that repeater on two meters so the switch works pretty good and by the way I have a cooling fan it's a computer fan for a power tower of a computer with an LED light just to keep the radio cool, I'm transmitting 75 watts. It's not supposed to need a fan. The 2900 does it, but just in case, felt good having a fan on it. But anyway, um, I highly recommend this. It it handles up to 600 megahertz. If you get one that's 30 or 32 megahertz, no good. You must have this one, CS201, Daiwa brand, on eBay, less than $40 for this switch. I just installed it, but I'm thinking about mounting it to the wall so it'll be more stable. But anyway, I uh, highly recommend that switch. If you want to put two radios on one antenna, switch back and forth. I'm going to look at getting a cable to put my DMR radio on it. Just received the DMR radio yesterday. Haven't got it going yet, but I'm going to be using this switch to uh, use my DMR on my J-Pole outside up about 40 feet. Anyway... Thank you all for watching.